horses if there were a mole in the way. Oh, that's ridiculous. Can you see that kid? He's funny. Alright, bye, sweetheart. Have a good day. Good morning, everyone. We just dropped Sienna off to school, and I came back home and realized that she had left all of her work is out of here. Her portfolio on the countertop. This girl, you guys. The amount of things that I have to drop off, it's insane. It's absolutely insane. I also have a huge, I don't know if you can see that red part, a huge blemish right on my eyebrow. But we're going like this. And we're going to drop it off because I believe she starts class right now. And she's probably like, oh my gosh, I forgot my portfolio. So I was like, she's probably like, uh, oh, my mom was just bringing up. I don't know what she's going to do when I get back to work. So I am right now, this is always the part that scares me. You ready for this? Ugh. Um, I'm making hard-boiled eggs because Jet today has to bring some hard-boiled eggs to school so he can dye them. And I'm hoping that when I open this, they're not all cracked. I did save a couple. I saved three of them. So, just in case. Okay, it appears just one, maybe two. I think the rest of them are good. Yay. All right. Um, I'm going to let these cool because I got to pack them up and he's got to take them to school. And yeah, we're just going to continue on the day. I do have some laundry that I have to do. It is an early day for me to drop Skylar off. So she has to go to school actually in an hour and 15 minutes. And then we have to pick them up at 12.30. Did I tell you guys that they have early dismissal? I think I did. I'm not really sure. Uh, they have early dismissal today. So it's kind of a crazy day. We have 10.20 drop off, 12.30 pick up, jet drop off at 12.45, and then jet pick up at 3.30, Sienna Violin at four and then home. We are gonna stop at the store today because I'm going to pick up a little, uh, I'm hoping I can find some little, I, th I, I believe Family Dollar sells it, but little you know, travel kits of things. I wanna put together like a little package and Sienna would like some toothpaste. So we are gonna get her some toothpaste. Um, she no longer uses the little kid kind, so. And I'd like to get some, uh, shower stuff for her shower, like a loofah, you know, like girl things. But I thought I would uh, just update you on how my morning's going. It's going pretty good. Everybody's up and at it. And I think that's all I have to tell you all. I'm looking at Sienna's desk, making sure she didn't forget anything. All right, I will check in with you guys um, once I get completely ready, because I am not ready right now. It is now 10 11. We are taking Skylar to school. I thought that I would update you all. We're here in the car. Let's get Dropper off. Love you. Love you too. Bye. Bye. Have a good day. Skylar is now dropped off, and we are at Family Dollar. How do I turn this down? We're at Family Dollar to pick up the things that I told you guys about. Just before. And, it's, and the TV's closed, but it's still on. Yeah, that's cool. Okay, let's go inside and get. I feel like I'm just like. I am just on a buying purchase extravaganza lately. I feel like I always do that when like something big is coming up, like vacation or Easter. But I thought we were doing a little car haul. Jet got some slime. I'm gonna try this spray on detangler. I have no idea if it works as well as the other stuff. But it works on wet and dry hair, so this is really good if your kids, uh, I 
forget, is it Johnson & Johnson? I think it is, Johnson & Johnson brand. Yeah, compared to Johnson's No More Tangles Tangling Spray. But it's for, again, wet and dry hair. It's really good for my kids wake up and their hair is all like matted in the back. I got some Colgate Optic White, um, high impact white for Sienna. Oh, she so asked for this toothpaste. I have no idea if kids are even allowed to and use it. We got Jenga to take on vacation with us or the Jumbling Tower. No, it's for Sienna's bathroom, the kids' bathroom, actually in general, I got the Grosjean Fortifying Shampoo and Conditioner. I also got a little thing of deodorant. For myself, I got some gum. I also got this spray because it reminds me of uh, one of my friends and my nanny when I was growing up. And she smelled like CK1 and oh my God, it's it like brings me back to the early 90s when life was so carefree and, and lovely so yeah. I also got some body wash for Sienna I'm trying to get my kids bathroom like stocked stocked up uh, instead of buying travel size shampoos and stuff I got one for the kids and one for me and Cody I'm just gonna fill these and hope for the best so I got that. My kids love Slim Jims. I have a really gross story about Slim Jim. I will tell that uh, when we get home. You want, do you want one now? Yeah. I got a loofah for the kids' bathroom. And then each kid got a little slime. They were a dollar. I'm not really sure why we got those. But. All right, let's head back home. I can't pop the lid off. Oh. You have to wait till we get home anyway. I thought I would quickly tell you my Slim Jim story. I'm not sure if I ever have mentioned the story. I feel like I have, I've told a lot of people of it. But if I haven't, here it is. So I was either 16 or 17 years old at the time of this occurring. And the reason that I say this is because I almost vividly remember driving to the dentist. Anyway, so I'm up in my room at my parents' house and I am eating a Slim Jim and I had one of the long ones. Like it was a pretty, it was a hefty Slim Jim and I bit down on it and I was like, oh no. And I bit down on something extremely, extremely hard, like really hard. And I'm like, oh my gosh, I just broke my tooth on a Slim Jim. So I spit everything out and I look down and sure enough, there's a huge chunk of a tooth. I'm like, oh my God. So I'm checking my teeth, can't find anything wrong anywhere in my mouth. So my mom calls the dentist. She's like, well, we'll go have him check it out and see if he can find something. So drive to the dentist. I have my little tooth that I bit down on in a baggie and the dentist, a feather, it's from the pillow. The dentist, looking around my mouth, he's like, I don't see anything. I said, well, I have what I bit down on. Hand it to the dentist, and he goes, and he looks at it, and he goes, Erica, this is a tooth, but this is not your tooth. How gross is that? I eat a tooth. Somebody else's tooth. Now, it could have been, you know, a cow tooth or whatever Slim Jims are made out of, uh, but it was gross. That is my Slim Jim story, but they are good. I don't know what's in them, clearly. Teeth. I do not feel like eating a Slim Jim ever. <laughs> I just ate one. <laughs> I just ate one. It's all right. All right, that is my story. I am going to sit here for probably the next 40 minutes. We're not going to start doing laundry or anything until later on probably the gap between i have to drop him off and pick him back up so we're gonna leave in about 15 minutes and we're gonna pick up mcdonald's happy meals for lunch I for do, everybody i do not see my cavity i do thank you mm -hmm. i don't you have just one more that you gotta get fixed right there and then you'll be all and then you'll be all done no it's right by your silver teeth Oh, it is. Oh, I'm gonna get up. Um, 
<laughs> anyway, we are gonna go get Happy Meals and then they'll all three eat Happy Meals while we take Jet to school. Hey. And we'll drop him off, then we will come back here, we will do laundry, and then we will pick Jet up, take Sienna to violin, then come back and make tacos for dinner because you guys have been craving tacos. Okay? Okay. You got me a you got me a one. How was your school day? Great. You're going to school today. How was your school day? Good. We're at preschool right now. About to drop Jed off. You look so excited. It is now a few hours later. I went home. We all went home. The only thing that I got accomplished is I took all the laundry that we are done with and I took it upstairs to my bedroom and I sorted it by person. And that was it. That's all I did. And I just sat and rested for the rest of the afternoon. It is now though 326, 25. Mm -hmm. 25, yep. And we are here back at preschool. We're gonna pick Jed up and then we have to take Sienna to violin. And then I don't know if I'll pick up Taco Bell or if I'll go home and make it. It all just depends on if I feel like cleaning out closets and tackling laundry tonight. We will see. Alright. I'm gonna go. We will see how Jet's day is. I feel real groggy. Real groggy. How was school? Did you dye Easter eggs? Mm -hmm. You did? Did everybody have enough? I only did two. Yeah, you're only supposed to do two. We are now at violin practice. In case you guys were wondering where exactly we were, that is where we are. I am... I'm gonna turn this down. I'm gonna turn this just for a second. Um, we're gonna wait for her to be done playing violin, wait, and then we're gonna try to carry on our day. Maybe. I'm hoping that... This is not the same movie. This is Two Brothers. Yay! I thought we would watch a little bit of that. I feel like something's in my mouth. I thought that we would try to get as much done as we Where's possibly can tonight. Milk? I drank it all. Anyway, I am gonna try to muster up the energy. I don't know why I'm so tired today as opposed to the past couple days, but I just feel like, you know, Funky yeah. funk. Get this go. Get this go. Right, Blue? You feeling a funky funk too? Feeling a funky funk. But my main goal is I just need to clean out the closets and get all of the laundry under control. I feel like I've just been putting it off for way too long. I just need to empty everything out into a big pile and go through it. And honestly, it would probably take me no longer than like two hours to do. It's definitely something I can complete tonight and be done. All right, I'll see you guys when this food's gotten out. I'll see you guys when Sienna gets out of violin. I forgot to ask you how violin was. Great. Good. The, um, then what's the precedent? Grapes. Um, what am I doing? Not real sure. We're going to make tacos is what we're going to do. Cody wants to grill out. I have cheeseburgers if he wants to grill, grill those. But I promised, I promised Skylar that we would have tacos tonight. So tacos is what I am going to make. I am still super low energy. I don't know what is going on today. If it's just like that time where I'm just tired all the time, I don't even know. But I took two B vitamins. I think they're starting to kick in. So maybe I'm just low on B vitamins, I don't know.
I wanted to tell you all that we're making tacos. It's 5.34. I don't know where this day has gone. I feel like I have not really accomplished anything that I've wanted to accomplish. It's making me feel unaccomplished. So we need to, to get in high gear, like I said. I do want to though stop by the tanning bed because I'm getting just pale. Like I'm getting fluffier and paler. And I'm supposed to be getting skinnier and tanner the closer vacation comes and it's like working the opposite. So we would just eat grapes right now and hope that that fills me up a little bit. So I don't eat chips like I have been doing. We also need to get out. We need to get out um, Ground beef. Oh, get back in there, sausage. So, we're gonna pick this up. And I need to brown them. I'm making tacos. Oh, I thought you were making tacos. Let me go ahead and get off the sour cream. And the cheese. Did I use the rest of the cheese? That's okay. We'll make it work. All right, let's make up these tacos. I'll show you when I'm done. So each kid has a special order. Mm -hmm. Two crunchy, one soft, one crunchy, one soft. Yeah, because I like soft. Yes, ah. you do. Sometimes you eat two. Depends on how hungry you are. It is now me. It is 6.40. We're in the car. I'm actually in front of a tanning bed. Somebody owns a McLaren. I think that's what that says. I think that's what that is. I don't happen to know anybody that rich. But I'm gonna go out and scope it out and see who it is. I need to get my tan on. Your girl is looking a little pale. So hopefully we can find a bed that's going to get me nice and toasty. All right, I'll be back. When now back at home, out of the tan bed. I used high action lotion if you're wondering why I'm all, all red, but I feel much, much better. I feel kind of ready for vacation. I wanted though to say good night to you all. I don't think I'm going to get to the laundry, unfortunately, unless I get like a sudden spurt of energy, then we'll go upstairs and do it. But if not, we'll tackle it together tomorrow. Uh, we'll, just, we'll just chalk this up as like a day of relaxation. All right, I hope you all take care. Have a wonderful Friday, and I'll see you guys tomorrow morning. Bye, everyone.